don't take today off. Hard work brings great rewards. You got all the talent in the world, but are you obsessed? There's no fucking passion. There's no fucking motivation. There's no, oh my God, man, I fucking, this is, no. It's every day of your life just doing. No passion. No discipline, no motivation. Yeah, all these words, I hate people. I hate that so many people fucking use these words now because it, it, it's watered. It's someone sitting in a room by themselves and they figure themselves out and say, God, this is going to fucking suck. Where's passion when you're 300 pounds? Where's the motivation when you can't read and write? Where is it? So how did this happen? I just fucking did. I just did. I said, maybe at the end of this journey, there'll be something there for me. If not, I can read. If not, I'm 185 fucking pounds. There's no, there's, 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 there's no magic potion. There's no, oh, let me wake up and look at some shit. No, all those words are overused. They're bullshit. It's all bullshit. Just do. You're living. How do you want to live? How do you want to die? How do you want to fucking be remembered? That's, that's it. That's it. Period. Stay to be happy about. You're up too old. Job's not finished. Job finished. So you put in 110% so every fucking person watching can undoubtedly see you and your fucking truth and how fucking hard you work. Champions are broken. Imagine walking out the door a loser. I'd rather die. I would rather die than be that loser guy. Think about that. Do you want to walk out that door a damn loser or do you want to walk out the door a winner? Think, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll fight to the death. And sometimes I actually went close to death. Mm -hmm. It sounds crazy, but you got to give it that much. If you want results, otherwise you'll be like everybody else. The majority of the population, they think they're praying hard. That was hard. That's what it takes to do anything successfully in life. You've got to want it as bad as you want to breathe. And if you want it that bad, if you're willing to give it that much, you get a big piece of what you want. You gotta get real doggish. Sleep, work, eat, train, repeat. It's simple. Fuck clubs, fuck partying, fuck trying to fit in and socialize. For me, I was more miserable trying to make everyone else happy than I am now with everyone else unhappy with me. And so I think like from the social group that I had before I quit my job, if we're going all the way like ground zero to today, I talked to no one <laughs> from that time in my life compared to today. And I was absolutely miserable and unhappy and unfulfilled. And I would say that the majority of those people probably don't like me today because I changed. I didn't do what I was supposed to do. He thinks he's so fancy now, et cetera, et cetera. And I think I'm just okay with that. And so, I think coming to terms with the idea that I could be absolutely rejected by everyone I know, but like me, I was more okay with that because the alternative was I didn't want to live anymore. And so every, obviously there's degrees and there's continuums and there's stages of where people are at with that. But as that being the taken to its logical extreme, would I rather live for them than live for me? I would rather be hated by everyone and like myself. It's your life, not theirs. Take ownership of your life. And if you need some more motivation, then follow DD Success and check out our videos, Stay Hard.